The call by President of the Public Services Association, Watson Duke, to stay home on Tuesday was largely ignored by the majority of the more than 5,100 workers employed at the Water and Sewage Authority. On Monday, PSA President Watson Duke called on the workers at the authority to take a day of rest, reflection and reset on March 2nd. The day was intended to send a message to government of the workers' resolve to stop the government from restructuring the authority. Newly appointed Executive Director and CEO of WASA, Dr. Lennox Seeley, told TDT News that over 90% of the workers turned out on Tuesday and operations were perfectly normal. Visits to WASA's customer service locations in Port of Spain and San Fernando confirmed that the authority's operations were not disrupted in any way on Tuesday. Mr. Duke, a manager employed at WASA who has been on no pay leave for more than a decade while he serves as president of the union, used his Facebook page to issue a direct call to WASA workers.